Hey guys, it's Mish, and today I wanted to answer the question of does sweating burn more calories during exercise than not sweating? First I'll just go into the mechanism of sweat, so what exactly does sweat do, and how does it work? So as I'm sure you know, you sweat when it's hot, and your body does this in order to cool yourself down. And how it works is you have millions of little sweat glands under your skin, and as your core body temperature heats up, they start to release water onto the surface of your skin, along with some other minerals and things that were in your bloodstream. And it cools you off through evaporative cooling, because when water turns from a liquid to a gas and evaporates from your skin, it actually requires heat to do this. And so it sort of uses up the heat on your skin, which therefore makes you feel cooler. And that's the reason that things like rubbing alcohol feel really cold on your skin, because they evaporate very quickly and at a lower temperature. And so it feels like it's taking more heat away from you. And so that's all that sweat does. It's just your body releasing some of its water onto the surface of your skin so that when it evaporates, it'll take some of your heat with it. And so it seems that your sweating correlates with how much effort you're putting into the exercise, because in general, the higher intensity of exercise means that your muscles are working harder, which means that they're hotter, which means that your core temperature is going up faster than someone who is just walking, let's say. And that's why people think that sweating is a good gauge of calorie burn. So there is some correlation, but really sweating is just dependent on how hot you are and how hot the environment is. And for example, working out in a hot environment or doing hot yoga might make you think you're burning more calories, but that is not true. You're just releasing more water. And so this whole idea that you should be working out in higher temperatures and sweating more to lose more weight is not only completely wrong, but it might be harmful to you because when you sweat, you lose not only body water, which could lead to dehydration, but you also lose sodium and potassium magnesium, calcium, chromium, iron, copper, all sorts of minerals that you need to survive that you would find in something like a multivitamin. So not only is sweating probably not a good thing for weight loss, but it might actually be a bad thing if you're deliberately trying to sweat more regardless of the intensity, so like working out in a hot environment. Because you might have to eat or drink more in order to replenish all those lost electrolytes and minerals and water. And while working out in hot weather might feel like a more intense exercise because your heart's having to pump faster because you're losing a lot of salt, which is lowering your blood pressure, meaning it feels higher intensity, it doesn't actually burn more fat than the same exercise in a cooler environment. You might burn a few more calories, but if you remember from my crossover concept video, the higher intensity induced by the hot weather means you're actually burning more carbs and less body fat. So my recommendation would be to work out in a cool area because then you're able to get to a higher intensity and sweat less while burning more fat and more calories without feeling completely miserable and drenched. However, if you enjoy working out in hot weather or like hot yoga, there's no reason to stop. It's just you're not getting an extra benefit from it being hot. And sweating does not detox you as far as the scientific literature says. It just gets rid of your minerals and electrolytes and water and some urea, which is what you excrete and pee. So. Your kidneys do a great job of detoxing you, and you do not need to sweat to do any more detox for your bloodstream. Moral of the story is, sweating does not burn calories, working out in hot weather does not burn more fat, so do your workouts at the intensity you enjoy in a nice air-conditioned room if you can manage it, <laughs> or at times of the day where it's not blazing hot outside, because there is no benefit to making yourself feel more miserable and drenching your clothes. Thanks for watching, and please share and subscribe to see more videos.